you told me a year ago that you would still be WWE Universal Champion, I wouldn't have believed it. I am delighted to disappoint you. Am I disappointed? You're a draw. For some reason, people seem to like you. It's just that damn insistence on doing the exact opposite of everything I say that drives me nuts. I've never been great with authority. How long are we gonna keep doing this? I am the most must-see general manager in SmackDown's history. You're the WWE Universal Champion with all the momentum. So what if we work together instead of being at each other's throats? Because this right now, this feels like yet another trap you're trying to spring. I don't trust you. Call it a choice between the carrot and the stick. The carrot is, I make you into a cross-platform superstar like WWE has never seen. Of course, you'll need to have a bit of an attitude change and be willing to get your hands dirty. Okay. And what's the stick? The stick is, reject my offer, and if you think it's been a hard year, you can't even imagine what's coming next. After what I'll put you through, you will never escape Roman's shadow. Interesting. Maybe that's exactly what I'd do. Escape his shadow and yours, too. What the hell does that mean? What it means is I hear NXT is a really cool brand. Never been. Maybe I take the undisputed WWE Universal Championship, head down to NXT, and go after the title that Roman never won. What? You have a contract. You can't just walk off my show. I don't know. After this past year, I think I've shown I can do just about whatever I want. Fine. You have a choice to make. Work with me and have everything you've ever dreamed of. Or I make you regret ever becoming a WWE superstar. The only stick you've got is the one we allow you to wield. So I'm gonna break it and go to NXT. Do this and you will be in breach of contract. The consequences will be enormous. Oh, I bet they will. If I'm Triple H, I'd look at the GM of SmackDown alienating the WWE Universal Champ so bad that he goes AWOL to another brand as a real negative in his next performance review. I wonder if Adam Pierce is available. You're going to regret this. You first. The rumors on social media were true. It's the undisputed WWE Universal Champion here on NXT. This is going to send shockwaves throughout the WWE Universe. SmackDown GM The Miz must be having a panic attack. I'd be too if my champion fled to another brand. We'll have to see if this is a one-time appearance or a more permanent move.
Hey there, champ. Wasn't expecting to see you here tonight. I guess you don't read social media much. Eh, I try not to. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you, Justine. I was a big fan of your work back in the day, and that comeback run with your niece was certainly memorable. Thanks. That was the point. Anyway, not sure if you've heard, but I've transitioned into a behind-the-scenes producer role here in NXT. So I can tell you that your request to have a match here tonight has been officially approved. Yeah, I actually already saw Shawn Michaels posted that. Maybe I do need to start paying more attention to social media. Nonetheless, we're excited to have you here at NXT for tonight. And maybe more long-term? What exactly is your plan? You sound like everyone else on the internet. But sorry, can't give you any scoops. I'll tell the world what I plan on doing here after my match. Fine. Good luck out there. And welcome to NXT for however long that ends up being. Well, look who it is. The high and mighty undisputed WWE Universal Champion himself has graced us with his presence here in NXT. I don't really know you, Grayson, but I assume that was sarcasm. Of course it was. You can walk in here with your fancy title, but I need you to understand that I'm the man around these parts, mate. Look. I get more than anyone what it takes to be a champion, so I respect what you've accomplished across multiple brands in WWE. There's no need to get defensive. I'm the NXT champion, so I'll get however I want to get. And by the way, I'm also the biggest box office superstar ever. So why are you even here on my show, trying to glom onto the Grayson Waller effect, I presume? <sighs> I've been getting that question a lot. But sorry, champ. You're gonna have to wait along with everyone else to find out. After my match. Here is the originator of British Strong Style. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Dudley, England. Weighing in at 175 pounds. Tyler Bates! Well, Bates made a real name for himself on both sides of the Atlantic. A founding member of NXT UK and now a fixture in NXT in the US. Now do yourself a favor and look up his NXT UK championship battles against the likes of Gunther and Butch. Some of the best matches in NXT history. Bate has run the show in every form of NXT but still has much to prove in all of WWE. And the Universal Champion steps into a new battleground here in NXT. And his opponent from Nashville, Tennessee, weighing in at 276 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. 
certainly would not have predicted we'd see the champ end up here. Nobody would have. But I guarantee there isn't an NXT fan anywhere who's complaining. Let's see how the Dark Horse's next chapter begins. Here's something you don't see every day. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion is having a match on NXT. Well, while we're certainly excited, there's one person who isn't, and that's SmackDown GM, The Miz. We don't know the champion's intentions here in NXT, but we do know Miz has already filed a complaint to Triple H and the board of directors regarding the champion's appearance tonight. We'll have to see how that all plays out. Oh, my goodness. You got to wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. Looking wobbly in the corner. Saku, do you know what? Tyler Bate in a state of distress. Bate has to wake up and fast. Hurled away. God. Stop after stop after stop. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. struggling a bit here. They've definitely taken their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. Wicked clothesline. He's falling victim here to a charge of attacks. Yeah, he has to devise some kind of new strategy here. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. Oh, not long. Look at this. Just what a barrage of stops. And more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. He's been placed in the corner now. And he's able to counter. Tyler is going to look to press on the advantage. And Tyler getting some newly to and he goes for the pin. And he breaks the count quickly. Showing his determination there with that kick out. Picture perfect drop kick. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex! You have to come down. That holds back Bates' attack. Big boot. German suplex. But that's not all. And a record lariat. What a combination. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. What a victory here on NXT for the WWE Universal Champion. But we still don't know why he's here in the first place. Patience, Saxton. I think we're about to find out. It feels damn good to be here in NXT to compete in front of all of you. And finally, get away from The Miz. But let me set the record straight and put all the rumors to rest. While this felt good to get my first NXT win, <laughs> it won't be my last. 
I'm not here just for a one-off appearance. <laughs> no. This, this is bigger than that. Every champion in WWE walks in the shadow of Roman Reigns. Me, more than any other. So I'm here because I want something that sets me apart from the head of the table. Something that Roman never won. And that is the NXT Championship. So Shawn Michaels, if you're looking for a can't miss main event, <laughs> I'm ready when you are. Did the WWE Universal Champion just ask for an NXT title match? Not sure how much of an ask that was. He's pretty much forcing Shawn Michaels' hand. Well, I know I'd love to see Grayson Waller go toe-to-toe -to -toe with SmackDown's champion. So would I, but he's going to have to get in line. Waller already has the defense lined up at NXT Battleground. Either way, it's going to be a huge matchup if and when it happens.